Hi everybody, it's Deanna Nichols, doTERRA Blue Diamond. I'm here with your oil a day, and today we will be discussing Terra Shield, which is doTERRA's repellent blend. Uh, naturally, if you're planning to use this, I assume that you're trying to repel insects, but I'm about to tell you how you can repel lots more than just insects, so it's pretty cool. Uh, I actually really like the smell of this oil, and I didn't really know exactly what all was in it, um, because for a long time I didn't really list the oils on the bottle. Uh, but one of the oils that's in here is rose oil, which is amazing, and that may be why it is such a, a favorite of mine. And we use it a lot around here for calming. But let's go to the um, intended purpose of the oil first, which is to repel insects. So there's lots of different oils in here that repel lots of different kinds of insects. You may be thinking of Terra Shield as just something that um, can repel mosquitoes or things like that, but it's also for crawling insects. So there's oils in here that can help repel cockroaches, silverfish. I hate those uh, those gross bugs, silverfish. Um, there's stuff in here that can help with worms, uh, like parasitic type worms, um, flies, let's see what else, um, mosquitoes, carpenter ants, head lice, and of course we know cedar wood is really great with ticks. So there's a lot of different bugs that you can repel with this. And there's a couple different ways you can use it. You can diffuse it, uh, especially near areas where bugs could come in. You can spray it on areas, maybe like uh, thresholds of doors and windows. And of course, right on you. And it's already diluted for you with fractionated coconut oil, so uh, you don't need to dilute it. You can actually get a um, spray top for this and take the little white part off, which you can do by just taking the lid and kind of tilting it. Let me see if you can see me do this. And then it pulls that part right off and then they have sprays sprayers that fit these that you can just screw right on or doTERRA has a um, already made this into a spray bottle so you can purchase the version that comes in a sprayer and that's kind of what we do a lot especially if we're going to use it um, when we're outside so we keep these in our car because um, if we're out and about and we decide we want to go for a hike or whatever, then we can just quickly spray it on. We like to spray it on our palms and then just kind of rub it on the areas instead of trying to spray it all over ourselves because I feel like you're really overusing the oil when you do that. Um, it's safe to put on babies um, and everybody and much safer than all of those toxic insect repelling sprays that are out there. I cringe every time I see a parent spraying their child down with pesticides um, and insecticides. It is just um, scary that we would be doing that. And then of course we have to breathe it in when other people are spraying it on as well. So this is a much safer option for you and your family. Um, there is also uh, some some um, emotional benefits to using the Terra Shield blend. We call it the oil of shielding, which makes a lot of sense. And so it can kind of help you feel calm when you're in the face of danger or an attack. And that can be a um, an emotional type of attack. So if you have somebody in your life that is um, often attacking you emotionally then um, or verbally or whatever, this can help you to kind of cope with that, especially if you're not able to, um, if you have to be around that person. Um, so diffusing this oil in your home can be good in those types of situations. It's especially been found to be helpful for um, children who seem to want to take on the strong emotions that are going on around them. And that could be because they're just much more sensitive, um, or it could also be because they just have not yet learned how to create boundaries between their feelings and someone else's feelings, especially if that person is an authority figure for them. So um, I've heard a lot of people say that this is a really helpful oil in, this, in the cases of divorce, where kids are going through all the emotional things that happen with that, that this could be a great one to help them to cope with that. Also, um, it, um, there are just people who are naturally inclined to try to lighten other people's burdens by kind of taking on some of their emotional issues. And sometimes we call those people empaths. And that's obviously not a healthy thing to do is to try to carry other people's burdens. And so this can help you to kind of create a shield around yourself so that you don't merge with other people's um, negative energy. So um, sometimes if I feel like I'm going to be around a lot of people, I'm, I'm very sensitive to other people's uh, emotions and feelings. And so if I feel like I'm going to be in um, around a lot of people, then I will often use Terra Shield. And one of my favorite ways to use it is just to take a little bit in my palms and then I just kind of scrunch it all through my hair, maybe on my clothes a little bit. And um, that just really helps me. Um, 
that's pretty much it, I think, unless you guys have anything else you'd like to share about your experiences with Terra Shield. It does have oils in here that are actually soothing to the skin as well, like there's sandalwood in here, cedarwood. Um, and so if you do get some sort of an insect bite, you can actually use this after the fact. Of course, it would be better if you could avoid the insect bite altogether, but um, um, you can also use this after if there's uh, uncomfortable feelings on your skin from, from contact with an insect. Uh, I do want to mention that this is safe to be used on pets, and you can definitely um, spray it in your hands and then mix it all through your, your pet's coat. And of course, just like any other essential oil, um, it's going to evaporate over time, and so it's got aromatic properties is what's causing it to work. So you will need to um, reapply it probably every four to six hours on your pet. It's not like one of those things that you can put on and um, it's going to last them for weeks or whatever because those things are um, toxic and that's why they last a lot longer in the body. So if you want to use it that way, you can. If you have any questions or other comments, please share them below. Holly's sharing that she has um, applied TerraShield on an insect bite before and that's just something that some of us may not realize is that we can do that. So those kind of tips are amazing and helpful so we always appreciate them even if you're not watching live you can comment below. We'd love for you to share the video. Thank you Avis for sharing the video. Um, that gives it more attention and helps more people to learn. We'll be back here tomorrow at 1 p.m. Eastern Time and that is facebook.com forward slash oil shares. Have an awesome day.